Something's chasing me. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. The sun sucks. I mean, sure, it gives us life and heat, but it's also really, really bright, like, all day long. And that makes it really hard to see stars during the day. I mean, look, can you see any stars right now? I don't. In fact, with all the photography I've done in my life, I've never really tried shooting the stars at night. But I'm gonna go try to do that right now. And I gotta head out to rural Virginia in order to do this, and it's getting kinda late, so I think dinner tonight will be Starbucks grilled cheese and a blueberry scone. <laughs> It'll be good enough. See what I mean? The sun is just super bright. Thinks it's all big and hot stuff and all that. And there's a lot of other stars out there too. And I'm not big on the sun's attitude. I gotta tell you. S-U-N, more like D-U-M. Burn. <laughs> Just burn the sun. It's ridiculous. So I'm about an hour or so from where I need to be, but it's just, it is so gorgeous out here. And I had to stop to say hi to all my buddies here. What's your name? Yeah? Are you good at doing stuff that you haven't ever done before? Do you like to step outside your comfort zone? I'm not sure how much he likes me right now, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. We just got here and turned off the lights and oh my gosh, it is just unreal. <laughs> just how dark it is and so then how bright everything else is. It's incredible. <sighs> and there's a lot of bugs. Skyline Trail, that's the one we need. It would have been a lot smarter if I'd brought a headlamp, uh, but I didn't, so we'll be okay. This isn't too long a trail. I mean, it is really, really, really dark. I think I have a really cool angle end up here where the Milky Way's coming in vertically in between a couple trees. Oh, this is just so cool. I can't believe I'm getting pictures like this. This is just, this is awesome. Skyline Trail, I think we're on the right path. Already learning some things, <laughs> what not to do this time that I should do next time. Number one, bring a headlamp. This is such a pain in the butt having to carry this thing around with me and blech. Number two, get a better tripod. <laughs> right now I'm just using my switch pod. So get a good head on just any kind of tripod would be better than this. Okay, so uh, this isn't a joke. Um, <laughs> we're shining my light ahead and I saw eyes. I definitely saw eyes. So I'm gonna go the other way and uh, leave whatever's over there over there. I don't need to do that. <laughs> There's no such thing as a Virginia bear or anything or mountain lion or coyote. <laughs> definitely saw eyes looking back at me. All right, quick update. This is not good. Something's chasing me. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm just kidding. Nothing was chasing me. <laughs> I'm good. I definitely saw eyes earlier, but nothing's chasing me right now. I don't think. Someone left a nice bench here. Oh, I'm so glad I've done this. And you know, I didn't get every shot that I wanted to, but that's okay. Important thing is, I got out and did it. And I'm walking around in the pitch black in the darkest spot in Virginia. <laughs> but it is worth it. Yeah, so, so much crazy stuff, a lot of it bad, <laughs> has happened in the last three months. But life goes on, right? I mean, we choose what we want to to focus on. And it's important to feel all those feelings, but I also, I'm glad that we are doing more things to try and take these tragedies and, and 
nothing else, use them to effect some positive change in our lives. I think that's what our moms would have wanted. Oh, and for the record, I don't hate the sun. I don't think it sucks. Please, stop all the mean, nasty comments. I love the sun. We're all good. Thanks. Thank you.